Hey, it's been a while since I've done a video, but I've been meaning to do this video and it's something I really, really have been wanting to put out there. And I'm so excited that I finally am just taking five minutes to do it because I've literally been thinking about it at least once a day for a month now. Shakeology and pregnancy. Everyone's favorite question for me is, are you still taking Shakeology? And is Shakeology still safe while pregnant? First, let's take two steps back. Am I still beach body coaching? Mm, kind of. I decided to switch gears a little bit. So am I still beach body coaching? Not as actively as I was. I'm turning to more local stuff, health and fitness wise, but I am still a beach body coach. To clear that up, I will take Shakeology lifelong, but not right now. So does that mean that Shakeology is not safe for pregnancy? No, not at all. But here's the thing. As a pregnant woman, you have to make the decision that is best for you and your baby. For me, I had two miscarriages while taking Shakeology. And while I don't think Shakeology caused them, if a doctor can't look at me and tell me for a fact that that is the case, it's just not worth it. I mean, it's nine months. And believe me, I am dying without Shakeology. Actually, the day of our gender reveal party, I had so much to do. Brett was working crazy overtime the days leading up to it. So it was basically just me getting ready for the party, doing all the shopping, cleaning, everything. And by the time the gender reveal party came, of course, Liam woke up at like 5.30 that day. So I had Shakeology. I felt amazing. Um, I'm not here to say Shakeology is bad. I'm not here to deny that it does amazing things for me in my life and that it's a real bitch keeping my diet on track without it and having energy. But what I am saying is that for me right now, it's not the right choice. Something that I think as Americans specifically that we all need to get better about is not relying on a person to tell us what is right or wrong for us. If you're pregnant or you're wanting to get pregnant and you're trying to make the decision, should I take Shakeology or should I not? Read the ingredients, do research, talk to your doctor. And when you're talking to your doctor, take that with a grain of salt because not all doctors are well-versed in nutrition. When I talked to my doctor, I felt a thousand percent confident because he read the ingredients, what he didn't know, he looked up in a book and on his computer, and he gave me a well-educated decision and opinion. And what he told me was, because of my miscarriages, he would like me to refrain for the first trimester, and then it was my decision after. So I felt really good about that. He told me the two ingredients that concerned him with my history of miscarriage, and we went from there. So that's just a side note. But you know what? You're pregnant. You're bringing a life into this world, and you can't rely on someone, especially not a beach body coach, to tell you what's right for you and your baby. No offense to any coaches, but every coach's favorite thing to tell a pregnant woman is, well, you had Wendy's, so why can't you have Shigology? I'm sorry, but that makes no sense. No, you should not be eating Wendy's when you're pregnant, but just because Shakeology has superfoods doesn't mean it's right for you when you're pregnant. It doesn't mean it's wrong for you. I have had so many friends who take Shakeology their whole pregnancy and have healthy, wonderful, vibrant babies. But again, it's only a decision you can make. So be empowered, do your research, and make the decision that's right for you. Bye, guys.